Scholarships make it possible to follow your dreams through a college education. One scholarship fund in the triad looks for students who demonstrate leadership qualities and excel in their studies. It's possible with the help of a community foundation. Fox 8's Katie Nordine introduces us to this year's recipient. Sid Visunathan has accomplished a lot so far in his life. I attended STEM early college at NCANT all four years. Um, I took college classes in 11th and 12th grades and got some um, college credits. The high school graduate and Eagle Scout has big plans for the future too. I'm going to UNC Chapel Hill and I'm going to study economics. I'm doing a bachelor of science and economics. A $2,500 scholarship will help him achieve those goals. During a recent ceremony, Howard would be extremely proud of you on the selection that we've made. Sid became the fifth recipient of the J. Howard Coble Scholarship. The fund was established in the late congressman's memory. Coble's family wanted a way to recognize his commitment to the people he served. He was well remembered, well cherished by both his Democrat colleagues as well as his Republican. Just in what he had meant to us growing up, uh, what he had done in his congressional life, we just wanted to do what we could to honor him. The High Point Community Foundation manages the donor fund. High school students in 14 counties Coble represented over his congressional career are eligible to apply. It's really awarding students who are doing all the right things. You know, bright students that are also service oriented and are doing the kind of things Howard would have done. Students like Sid get much more than tuition help. They receive support that will last a lifetime. So I have some amazing people backing me. In High Point, Katie Nordine, Fox 8 News. An interesting side note here, it was Congressman Coble that helped Sid's parents immigrate to this country when they did. So that was kind of a full circle event there. Anyone can make a donation to, to the Howard Coble Scholarship Donor Fund. We have put information on how you can do that on our website, myfox8.com. You can look for the story under the Spotlight tab.